My beloved brothers and sisters, I greet you who are living in Mozambique. Really, I pray that the Almighty God may help you who are living in Mozambique. Hallelujah. Yes, we are still praying for Mozambique. We are still praying for you. And I know God, hallelujah, is in control. He is in control. What happened in Mozambique, really a lot, a lot happened in Mozambique right now. But which I will, I'm delivering this message from the Lord. Hallelujah. So the Lord, the Lord God may help this country, really. May he help Mozambique. Hallelujah. So the Bible says in the book of, um, the Bible says, when we read in the book of uh, Matthew 18, verse 15 to 16, we, the Bible says, Moreover, if your brother, if your brother sins against you, and they go tell him his fault between you and him alone, this is what the Bible says, between you, between you and him alone, if he hears you, hallelujah, you have gained your brother. But if he will not hear, take it with with one, with one or two or three more. So you have to go and see your brother. You may sit together. You may agree. You may talk. What went wrong between us? We have to sort it out. We have to fit for the sake of our nation. Here I'm talking to the leaders. Hallelujah to the opposition party of uh, of um, of Mozambique opposition parties, and I'm also talking to the leader, the the ruling party. Hallelujah, Mareza. The Bible says again, okay, but if he will not hear, you take with you one or more or two or three more br uh, 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 brothers. Are you getting this? More other more two brothers. You go and see that person, communicate with that person well, so that you may settle the matter. So, this is so important, my brothers and sisters who are living in Mozambique. It's very, very important that really you need that unity in this specific time. Mozambique is really, uh, is really going through a lot. Hallelujah. So, if the ruling party, uh, with, we saw with, uh, with Daniel Chapo and then other opposition party, if they don't sit down and settle this matter, they will bring more chaos in this country. And then more... Uh, is Mozambique can't will, will be leaving their country because the situation of this country is as soon the spirit got so worse. But this required unity among the ruling party and then and the opposition party. They have to come together. If they fail to do that, the, the more more chaos and more famine who may strike the land of Mozambique. And then these want to be good for this country. Hallelujah. So the situation may get worse. After a period of a year, a, a lot will happen in this country which want to be favorable for the people who are living there in Mozambique. So we don't wish this to happen to you. We are praying for you, but we are praying more for the spirit of unity. Yes, by the election time, a lot went wrong. Yes, a lot went wrong. So we are not here to expose that, but I can speak and I can, I can speak to you again. A lot went wrong, but what should you do? You have to come together. Hallelujah. You will have to come together and they agree to each other. Settle the matter. Hallelujah. And the, the Almighty God will give you grace and give you favor. And then things will may move again well in your country. Hallelujah. May the Almighty God really bless you and be with you. The spirit of unity, is, it is what you need. The Bible says in the book of Psalms 133, uh, 133, verse, verse 1 to 2, how good and how pleasant it is for the brethren to dwell together. So if you create that spirit of unity and love among you leaders in the Mozambique in this specific time, then it will be good for this country. If you are going to carry on with division, then you may expect the worst to come in this country. Love you. Keep it. Shalom and bye for now. Thank you.